you have to get three. No, two, because I want to with daddy two times. And I paid my, myself with my own money. I guess so yesterday I went out bought a Xbox 360 bundle 50 bucks thought it'd be a good deal trusted the guy that it would work get home turn it on and sure enough it's got that beautiful red ring of death rookie mistake and that's I guess that's rule number one don't trust anybody whenever you're buying and reselling Luckily, it came with enough games. I think I can make my money back. It came with like 12 games, but it's mostly these Rock Band Guitar Hero games. One Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2, and Halo. The rest is Guitar Hero, etc. They come with three controllers. They're pretty nasty, but they'll clean up nice. And they all seem to work pretty well. They even got the cable extenders on it. And it has all the cables, so I should be able to salvage what I made. It also came with a guitar. But also today I went to went to a pawn shop, showed a little bit of it. The uh, guy working there and he brought out, he was getting out all the games. I pretty much wiped out all of his uh, Super Nintendo, regular Nintendo and Nintendo 64 games. So I want to go through all of this live with you, just show you what all I got. I paid $3.75 for the lot. That's had Tetris 2 and I'm going to have him take it out of its case. Uh, we got side pocket for the NES. It's in great shape. It's also got the manual. Um, got Tiny Toon Adventures. No manual with that one. And then I've uh, never seen this one before. Uh, Puzzing? Pizzing? <laughs> I think it's Puzzing? Puznik? There we go. Not sure what it is. It's got the manual with it as well. Um, it included in that deal, we got a really nice Sega Genesis. Uh, has all the controllers. Came with a controller, we got uh, RF cable, power supply, we got, of course, the black game cube here. No game inside, unfortunately. We got a controller with that. We got Nintendo 64, as you can see there, it's got the jumper pack with it. Comes with controller. Cable, AV cable, which I've got an extra power supply. I'm going to plug into it, make sure it turns on and everything. An extra controller. And then we got uh, more power cables for the GameCube. AV cable and uh, power supply. And then this huge box full of games. So, let's try to go over it with you guys here. Uh, Mighty Bomb Jack. Looks like we got Mike Tyson Punch-Out, which is a nice inclusion. Robocop. It. Nah, okay. Yeah, Mighty Bomb Jack, Mike Tyson's Punch Out, Robocop. We got Russian Attack, Mrs. Pac Man. We got Robo Warrior. A lot of these came in sleeves too, so that's always nice. Anticipation. Yep. First video board game. I've never seen that game before either. Uh, Rubber Warrior, we got Commando, uh, Bump and Jump, yeah, Bump and Jump, a lot of these games I've never seen before, I'm not sure what the prices are on them, I think it came out to an average of uh, $4, just under $4 a game, so, uh, Star Voyager, uh, MTV Remote Control, and like I said, a lot of these I've never seen before, uh, Top Gun, California Games, Will of Fortune, uh, we got the Karate Kid, Hollywood Squares, Let's see Jack Nicholas Goth, Bugs Bunny, Millions, Millions Secret Castle. All these look to be in really good shape. Uh, got Dr. Mario. Another anticipation. 
Mario and Duck Hunt. Follow new. Sorry about that. Uh, got another copy. Well, when I was finding new. Then we got Back to the Future. Uh, Paperboy. Always a favorite game of mine. Baseball. We got Top Gun. Another fun game. Kings of the Beach. Uh, Star Force. Very nice. Got Tetris. And uh, Tetris 2. Side Pocket. Get that up. To come to me, or is that just a case? Oh, okay. Good old Rambo. Shake, rattle, and roll. Snake, rattle, and roll. Got a uh, Dig Dug 2. Another Super Mario Brothers. Um, Pipe Dream. Missed that one. Dragon Warrior. Uh, Pac Man. We got Karate Champ. Marvel Madness. And Dodgeball. And SNES games. We got uh, Top Gear, Jack Nicholas Ska, Royal Fortune. We got uh, Star Wars for the N64, Shadow of the Empire. Pinball. And Tasmanian Devil. Mario Paint. Not sure what that one is. UN Squadron. And NHL 95. So, you guys let me know how you think I did. I paid 375 for this lot. A little higher than I wanted to pay, but I wanted to wipe the guy out. So, basically, I have no competition here now. And I feel like I can definitely get my money back with all of this, especially with everything spiking in price right now. So, anyway, guys, I appreciate you tuning in. And wait, I actually forgot. Got one more thing I actually purchased off the Macari. So, another Nintendo 64. I think I paid 100 bucks for this lot. But mostly I did it because it had the jumper expansion. Uh, four games, Perfect Dark, and the rest is a. Uh, Gex games, I think one, two, and three, or two, three, four. I can't remember. And then, yeah, probably overpaid for that too. But with the games, I thought it was a really good deal. So, with everything spiking right now, good time to sell them, guys. So, anyways, thank you guys for tuning in. Hope you like, comment, subscribe, and see you next time.